Hey guys, what's up? I'm having today with another video, and today is day 70. And I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm bloated. I don't feel like doing much of anything, but I'm still going. I only have five days left. Five days left. So I gotta kick my own butt in this way to get through this last five days and hope to goodness that all the bloating and everything will go away <laughs> by day 75 so I can have a nice picture and video to show you guys and my weight will not be like skyrocketed because of it. But I'm still pushing through, still going, still doing my best. I don't really feel like talking. I've been talking for the last few days anyway. I don't feel like talking a lot today. So I'm going to do my arm workout with you guys. And then, of course, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Besides that, I'm really, really, really concentrating on making sure that I am getting ready for the next challenge as the new year is coming up. And so this next 75 days will be around when New Year's will be. So even though technically I'll be going through the holidays, it's okay because I'm like, hey, at least for New Year, <laughs> I'll be feeling a lot better. And honestly, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Thanksgiving, Christmas, I don't need to be eating like that anyway. So I'm still gonna do 75, either medium or hard. Um, for the next 75 days, but I think I'll do a week in between to kind of get my self together a little bit and set up everything. I'm sure I'll probably do like a video at least one time during that week to kind of show you guys what I'm doing. And if you guys want to join in, then I can kind of give you guys all the information, but I'm trying to like very much plan this next time <laughs> versus this time when I kind of was just like, doing 75 hard and I just did it and not really with the exact plan in mind especially not one that I was like this is for sure what I'm going to do I just kind of did the check off everything and um going from eating maybe three times a week outside of the house to not eating any food outside of the house was a big diet change for me so that was like the diet concentration and I was trying to eat more whole foods and things and um, I want to actually stick to an actual diet plan. Like I told you guys, I got the Valencia diet actual paper. So I want to actually stick to that and show you guys my meals through that. Pick an actual workout um, calendar and have a structure even with my workout. I was telling you guys I wanted to do uh, Insanity. But I'm thinking about doing Insanity. Well, some version of Insanity. I'll let you guys know for sure which one. And then um, topping that off, if it's not longer than 45 minutes, topping it off with the treadmill, jump rope, something like that at the end. But it just depends if I do 75 hard or I do 75 medium. But I'll for sure know what I want to do. I have some books that I still need to read, so that's also what I'm trying to do um, for the rest of the year. As I told you guys, that I just have been in the habit of reading and I've really just been enjoying all of the books that I've been reading, so I really want to stick to reading and going with that. <sighs> Besides that, I'm just, it, you know, everything's a plan, and I just want to be more action-oriented and not just tell you guys, but I want to have some type of structure so that I can um, share it with you guys if you want to join in with me. I am exhausted <laughs> very much today, so I just want to get this workout over with. I'm going to try to do it for you guys and um, it's arm day of course my favorite day so at least I get that pleasure but I've been pushing myself as hard as I can um, I even was thinking with the grow with Joe videos I'm so grateful I did do those videos because it has allowed me to have more stamina I think and it will make it easier for me to do insanity or some type of insanity and um, I know insanity really, really pushed me. I feel like with Grow With Joe, especially because I was a lot heavier, it was very hard for me to do the exercises. So like I told you guys, I've been um, changing it enough so that I'm able to at least keep moving. And um, I don't feel like it was super hard because it was easy for you know me with knee problems and everything at the beginning. And most of the time I might have been giving about 30%, 40% so I was still moving my body 45 minutes is a long time and then probably the last couple minutes I'm really pushing. But it, it's been 
a reality check a little bit because I'm like, oh man, I was a lot bigger, a lot heavier, so it was a lot harder for me to move, but I do want to this 75 hard challenge this time really really push myself every day and really try to give that 100 percent and i know some days i'll only get 50 or only get 30 but that's okay i want to do more of that because i feel like i'm able to move a lot more i want to stop limiting myself to only doing up upper exercises and really try to push myself to do more um, on the floor to get push-ups and to get my you know on the floor exercises down okay guys let's get right into this workout i'll see you guys after Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Definitely make sure to hit that thumbs up button if you haven't already. And make sure you click on that subscribe button if you haven't. And turn it on in case you so you can be notified every time I post a video. I love you guys. I love you guys. I love you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Bye, guys.